Welcome back to another edition of DXB Today. It is our sustainability special for you. Um, and Ash and I have been very sustainable, that's why we're staying on the sofa. Mm -hmm. and we've sent Katie away to do the hard <laughs> yards, that's for sure. Meanwhile, uh, our very own Faris uh, has been out and about. He caught up with some of the art exhibitors participating at Wetex. What's that? It's the uh, region's largest sustainability and clean energy technology exhibition. It was held a couple of uh, weeks ago, in fact, just a couple of days ago. Um, and of course, COP28 on the horizon. We went down there, or rather Faris did, to ask some of those participating what COP28 means to them. Let's have a look. Here we are at Wetex to discover even more technologies and innovations to make sure that the UAE and specifically Dubai are the new hub for sustainability in the region. Wetex is a, is a premium exhibition and we, we always attend and we take pride in showcasing our latest technology. Well, I think this has been a, a great venue for us. Uh, we're actually relaunching Smart Flower in the UAE and we chose Wetex as the, the venue to announce our new partnership with our, our distributor partner here in the region. And you know, I think Dubai is, is in a really good position to actually exhibit what a, what a great and sustainable city it is first and foremost. Governments have a role, industries have a role, individuals have a role, and I think education has a huge role. Events like COP28 are incredibly important uh, globally, but very much in the region. It really helps to highlight and bring to the fore these key issues around climate change and sustainability, and it brings it really much into everyone's lives when it's happening right here in Dubai, as it is uh, with COP28. COP28, this is not the first COP. We are one of the strategic partners of COP. We are there in, in, in most of the previous versions of COP. A company like Cisco, um, to be front and center in both the green zone and the blue zone, to get a chance to meet the world's leaders, to get a chance to exhibit a lot of our sustainable technology, um, I think will be, will be excellent. It'll put Cisco on the front foot. One of the key ways that we walk the talk at Expo City Dubai is by supporting startups. And that's what we do at the Expo Live Innovation Program, supporting startups from around the world that have a meaningful impact in society and in the environment. And in just a couple of weeks, we will be bringing a lot of them to COP28 to make sure that they can tell their story introduce them to the world so that what they do begins to be more recognized and be better supported for futures to come. Well, I've definitely learned a lot. And if we keep seeing technologies and innovations just like this, I think it's very, very good news for the climate situation and for sustainability. And I can't wait to see what we're gonna see at Wetex 2024 and even sooner than that, COP28. Faris really nailing the walk and talk there at Wetex. It was fascinating. Now the walk and talk is one thing. Now it is time to actually do a workout in the studio. But before we do, I actually want to catch up with the founder of Bar Effects. Joining us in the studio right now is Nora Hamidani. How are you? I'm good. Thank you for having me. Uh, we're really, really excited to have you here. I love Bar anyway in itself. But for those perhaps watching that don't know what Bar is, first of all, tell us about that. Sure, bar is a low impact strength training exercise. It incorporates Pilates, yoga, and dance. Okay, all of them together? All together. Okay, because you hear the word bar and you think of the ballet bar. That is what it is, right? Yes, we do use the ballet bar for different exercises, but we also use props and our own body weight. Okay, now that sounds a little bit more interesting. So why would you encourage people to use bar as a form of exercise? Sure, so bar not only is strength training, but also stretching and you can get your cardio. So it's like a one-stop shop for all of your exercise in under an hour. Um, another great thing about bar is that it's for everyone. So if you're working with an injury, if you're pregnant or postnatal, um, if you're a beginner, more advanced, bar works for everyone. Yeah, and that's the thing. And it looks, as you will see when Nora takes me through the workout very shortly, it looks very low impact, but my goodness, it can really burn and you definitely feel like it. So as you say, if you have got an injury then, how does bar help that? 
So you can always speak with the instructor to modify the exercise. Everything is low impact, so there's no jumping, there's no heavy weights. Like I said, we use a lot of our own body weight. Mm. So it's actually strengthening your muscles and your joints. Amazing, I can't wait. And so talk to me very quickly about the Studio Bar Effect. How sure. long ago did you find it and tell me about it? So January, it'll be three years since mm -hmm. I founded it. Uh, we're a team of 10 different instructors, so we all have different style, different energy and music. Every class is different. Um, and with bar, it's ladies only. So um, we do have special events, but primarily in the studio, it's just for ladies. And the studio's in Al Safa One, um, right on Al Wassel Road. Amazing. Well, listen, I can't wait. I know I'm going to head down to the studio at some point, but we are going to do a, a workout very shortly. But for now, Ashwarya, it's back to you, and I'll get ready. Thank you, Katie. Looking forward to your workout a little bit later while Tom and I enjoy the comfort of this couch right here. <laughs> Are you feeling okay? Are you yeah, tired? No, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, Let's I think we should just sit and stretch for watch. a bit. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Anyway, we'll catch up with Katie in just a bit. I hope you've enjoyed today's sustainability filled episode. We are just getting started with COP28 just days away. If you'd like to catch any of our content, if you've missed out on any of the episodes, you can check us out on YouTube at Dubai One TV. Uh, also, make sure you do check out our Insta page as well. There it is, the uh, handle up on the page as we speak at the moment. Uh, that gives you an opportunity to see some of the things that go on behind the scenes here. Do also uh, check in with us again tomorrow, back again around about the same time, 8 p.m. tomorrow evening, right here on Dubai One TV. What are we doing tomorrow? Eating, obviously. We are delving into some of the great culinary cities right here uh, in Dubai, but also right here on the show as well. Time now, though to quite literally raise the bar. <laughs> oh, boom. Nice one, nice boom. one. Nice Over one. to you, team. <laughs> so I'll take you through some of my favorite moves. Okay. And we're gonna grab the ball. Yes. We're gonna come to an upright V. So you bring the ball in between your knees and then you bring your heels to touch and your toes just a little bit apart. How do you do? Okay, yes. oh, okay, I've got it. Hand on your hip. Hand on my hip. Lift your heels up mm -hmm. and then we start to pulse down and we squeeze. Squeezing my knees at the same time? Yeah, using your inner thighs, using the muscles of your hips, of your thighs, and then we try to get a little bit lower. Of course more we into do. the burn. This is Sonora, Yeah. So we should get lower, okay. And then our next move, yeah. we can take the ball out. We come to our wide second. So, step your feet nice and wide, turn mm -hmm. your toes out like a second position in ballet. Okay. Ball between our palms, bend your knees, come low. <laughs> Come on down, good. And then here again we pulse. Do you like the way that pulse. Ash and Tom are just laughing at me right now? Oh, hang on, you're a lot lower than I yeah, am. Yeah, you're okay. tall. Okay. And then you can squeeze the ball in between your palms. Yeah, yeah how that works, your arms as well. Yeah. You look good, you're Thanks. natural. <laughs> so low, good. Let's do four more. Three, two, and up. Ooh, okay. gosh, yeah, okay. One more, yeah. best one. We can leave our ball. Yeah. Grab your light weights. We come down to the mat, and this is called our thigh dance party. Okay. Good, so open your knees just a little bit, and then we're gonna start to lift our hips up, and as we lift, we can punch one arm than the other. Yes. You're moving very fast. Good, we have our thighs, our arms, our core. Looking Hang on, I'm good. not in, there you go. Yeah, there I'm we go, we're together. In sync. Hey.